This is Biochemistry Lab 3, Group Future Doctors, and we will be reviewing Oast House Urine Disease. So what exactly is Oast House Urine Disease? Well, let's take a look. So as you can see in this picture, Oast House Urine Disease is a recessive inherited metabolic disease that causes some pretty significant signs and symptoms. But let's take a closer look. What amino acids are involved in oyster house urine disease? The amino acid that's involved is methionine. This disease is a malabsorption syndrome of methionine where it is not converted by an intestinal bacteria into an acid which gives the urine a distinct hop-like odor. The enzyme that is deficient in oyster house urine disease is the methionine adenosyl transferase because methionine cannot be converted that is deficient in, is methionine. Reason for enzyme deficiency is the malabsorption of methionine due to an autosomal recessive disorder. Which molecule concentration increases? Alpha hydroxybutyric acid in the urine, methionine, and alpha hydroxybutyric acid in the stool. Demonstrate the chemical reaction. The amino acid methionine, which contains sulfur, cannot be absorbed. Thus, the alpha hydroxybutyric acid is formed by intestinal bacteria of the methionine, and this increases in the alpha hydroxybutyric acid shows up in the urine and stool. The gastrointestinal bacteria ferments the excess methionine into alpha hydroxybutyric acid, creating the distinct odor in the urine. Signs and symptoms: tapopenia, mental retardation, methionine malabsorption. Urine has a caramel hop oven smell white hair, diarrhea, convulsions, seizures, and individuals is prone to infection. Is this disease age or gender specific? No, this disease is a genetic disease that is very rare and thus is not specific to any age or gender. So based on all these signs and symptoms, how do you diagnose Oast House urine disease? Well, you can diagnose this in a number of ways. You can perform blood and urine amino acid determination tests, or gastrointestinal tract ultrasonography CT examinations of the stomach. And since the urine has a distinct odor, like hops, you can order tests to confirm the diagnosis. You should also order tests if you see any of the other signs and symptoms that we discussed on the previous slide. And what about prevention? Is this disease preventable? No. It is not preventable because it is a metabolic defect that is recessive and has an onset in infancy. With all this said, what is the treatment of this rare disease? Well, some treatments include a low methionine diet. Because this disease is a malabsorption problem, all you'd have to do is restrict methionine within the diet and you'd reduce the signs and symptoms of the disease. Another treatment of this disease would be the use of antibiotics and also symptom treatment, such as abdominal massage to strengthen abdominal blood circulation. Now you see our work cited for this presentation, and that will conclude our presentation on human biochemistry concerning Oast House Urine Disease. We hope you enjoyed it and learned something new.